सिंप्लीफाई फोर्थ रूट ऑफ एटी वन माइनस एट इंटू थर्ड रूट ऑफ टू हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन प्लस फिफ्टीन इंटू फिफ्थ रूट ऑफ थर्टी टू प्लस रूट ऑफ टू ट्वेंटी फाइव आई नो दिस लुक्स वेरी कॉम्प्लेक्स स्पेशली टू द स्टूडेंट्स हु आर न्यू टू दिस टॉपिक बट बिलीव मी इट इज नॉट डिफिकल्ट इफ यू हैव लर्न एंड अंडरस्टूड द रूल्स ऑफ एक्सपोनेंट्स यू विल बी एबल टू सॉल्व इट इन नो टाइम एंड एट ईज लेट अस सी हाउ इट कैन बी सॉल्व सो द गिवन क्वेश्चन इज फोर्थ रूट ऑफ एटी वन माइनस एट इंटू थर्ड रूट ऑफ टू हंड्रेड सिक्सटीन प्लस फिफ्टीन इंटू फिफ्थ रूट ऑफ थर्टी टू प्लस रूट ऑफ टू ट्वेंटी फाइव नाउ माई ऑब्जेक्टिव इज नॉट टू गिव यू द सोल्यूशन स्ट्रेट अवे राधर हेल्प यू अंडरस्टैंड हाउ टू फाइंड द सोल्यूशन सो हाउ आर वी गोइंग टू क्रैक दिस प्रॉब्लम सो द फर्स्ट पॉइंट दैट वी सी इज द प्रेजेंस ऑफ रेडिकल साइंस सो सम हाउ वी हैव टू रिड्यूस दिस रेडिकल्स टू अ मोर फ्रेंडली फॉर्मैट हाउ कैन वी डू इट इट इज ईजी वी हैव ऑलरेडी लर्न वन आइडेंटिटी दैट सेज एंथ रूट ऑफ ए इज इक्वल टू ए टू दी पार वन बाय एन सो फर्स्ट थिंग वी नीड टू डू इज जस्ट यूज दिस आइडेंटिटी टू कन्वर्ट दीज रेडिकल्स इन टू फ्रैक्शन सो दिस कैन बी रिटर्न एज एट्टी वन to the power 1 by 4 since it is fourth root minus 8 as it is into 216 now there is third root that means we can put it as 1 by 3 plus 15 no radical so just write it as it is then we have 32 to the power 1 by 5 since it is the fifth root plus 225 Here we have the square root that is two, so we put it as one by two. Now in the next step, we have to simplify it further. So we have eighty one here, two hundred sixteen here, thirty two here, and two twenty five over here. If we break it down in its prime factors and write these prime factors in terms of their power. it would be easy for us so let us do this the first term is 81 so 81 if we take the factors this is 3 2 are 6 remainder 2 1 3 7 are 21 then we have 3 9 27 3 3 9 so you see we have 3 to the power 4 which can be written instead of 81 so we get here 3 to the power 4 Whole raised to the power one by four, which is already there. Next, we have minus eight into two hundred sixteen. Now we have to find the factors of two hundred sixteen, which can be done very easily. Do this in your rough work. Make a rough column on the right hand side of your copies while doing these questions, and do all these factorization or extra calculations in that rough section. So we have. 216. Take the factors. Two ones are two. Zero two eights are sixteen. Then we have two fives are ten. Two fours are eight. Two twos are four. One four two sevens are fourteen. Then we have three nines, twenty-seven. Three threes, nine. So if you see, we have three twos and three threes. That means two to the power three. Into three to the power three. So here we write two to the power three into three to the power three, and this whole is raised to the power one by three, which is already there. Next we have plus fifteen thirty-two. So the factors of thirty-two we have. Two sixteen are thirty-two. Two eights are sixteen. Two fours are eight, and two twos are four. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Two to the power 
5 which can be written over here that is 2 to the power 5 to the power 1 by 5 plus next we have 2 to 5 so let's find the factors of 2 to 5 can be divided by 5 we get 5 fours as 20 remainder 2 5 25 5 fives are 25 then we have 5 nines are 45 3 3's are 9. So you see we have 2 times 5 and 2 times 3. So this can be written as 5 square into 3 square. So here we get 5 square into 3 square whole raised to the power 1 by 2 which is already given. Now simplifying it further, again we have lots of exponents. So we are going to use one more identity rather if you look at the complete expression we will need two different identities one is a to the power m to the power n is equal to a to the power m into n while the other identity is a into b whole to the power m is equal to a to the power m into b to the power m so we are going to use these two identities with different terms for example the first one that is 3 to the power 4 whole to the power 1 by 4 this is identical to the identity written in yellow so we get 3 to the power 4 into 1 by 4 that is a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m into n minus 8 into now here if you see we have the expression in the form a into b whole raised to the power m is equal to a to the power m into b to the power m written in green. So let's use this. So we get here 2 to the power 3 into 1 by 3 multiplied by 3 to the power 3 into 1 by 3 plus 15. Here we can use the identity in yellow. So we get 2 to the power 5 into 1 by 5 plus now here we need to use the identity in green that is a b to the power m is equal to a to the power m into b to the power m so we get 5 to the power 2 into 1 by 2 into 3 to the power 2 into 1 by 2 now it looks simpler and easier you see here this 4 cancels out this 4 here this 3 cancels out this 3 here 3 cancels out 3 here 5 cancels out 5 here 2 and 2 here also 2 and 2 leaving 1 wherever we have this cancellation so here we get 3 to the power 1 that is 3 minus 8 into 2 to the power 1 that is 2 into 3 to the power 1 that is 3 plus 15 into 2 to the power 1 that is 2 plus 5 to the power 1 that is 5 into 3 to the power 1 that is 3. Simplifying it further it gets 3 minus 8 into 216 into 348. So here we have 48 plus 15 into 2 that is 30 plus 5 into 3 that is 15. Now you can see a question that was looking so complex is now so simple. Next step is equal to here we have plus 30 plus 15 and plus 3. These will add up together and we have only one term with negative symbol. So let it be like that. So here we have 3 plus 30 plus 15 which is equal to 538 314 that is 48. So we get 48 and we already have minus 48 which gives us 48 minus 48 as 0 and that is our answer. So see this is how we solve such complex problems rather I would say these are not complex problems but they are just looking complex 
डोंट गेट स्केयर यूज द आइडेंटिटीज यूज द लॉजिक्स यूज द प्रोसीजर्स एंड यू विल गेट द आंसर इन नो टाइम बिलीव मी स्टडी मेयर नॉट एनी मोर 